Unveiling the secret to handling disrespect isn't as straightforward as you might think. It's not about putting others in their place, engaging in a tit-for-tat of disrespect, or needlessly initiating conflicts. It's a transformative shift, an evolution that propels you from a cat to a lion in the blink of an eye. It's not about how quickly you move, but how keenly you think. And once you've mastered the art of sharp thinking, victory becomes a regular occurrence. But before we journey any further, I present a challenge to you. Hit that subscribe button. By doing so, you're not merely becoming part of a community of like-minded individuals, but you're also adopting a philosophy that places you ahead of the 99%. The wisdom you acquire here can be the game changer in how you navigate this thing we call life. If these insights resonate with you, consider sharing them with others who may also benefit from seeing things from a different perspective. Together, we cultivate the fortitude to face life's challenges with honor and respect, a skill known to only a select few. We're not akin to the masses. We think, we act, and we grow, all while upholding our core virtues and constantly enhancing our knowledge. We're not just discussing philosophy. We're forging ourselves into better individuals. So, now that you've subscribed, let's delve deep into today's topic. How to command the respect you rightfully deserve from others. The astute and stoic way. As stoics, let's approach this subject with discerning eyes. Picture those moments when respect appeared to slip through your fingers like fine sand. It's in those times when a colleague may have dismissed your input, a friend spoke out of turn, or a loved one seemed to take your efforts for granted. How did it make you feel? What thoughts coursed through your mind when confronted with such disrespect? Did you instinctively fire back in the same manner? Did you feel offended? Or did you draw in a deep breath and contemplate, why is this person treating me this way? The Stoics grasped a fundamental truth. Respect isn't a one-way street, but a reciprocal exchange. While it might be tempting to mirror others' treatment of you, only the weak follow this path. Only the feeble hurl back the same stones that were cast at them. In contrast, wise Stoic individuals take a different approach. They carefully analyze and reflect before responding to disrespect. By understanding the root cause of the disrespect, they uncover the most effective way to address it. Imagine a scenario where a colleague consistently undermines your contributions during team meetings. The knee-jerk reaction might be to meet their disrespect with defiance, but the stoic approach calls for a different response. Instead, you take a moment to reflect. Is their behavior rooted in professional insecurities or personal frustrations? This pause grants you the space to choose a more strategic and effective course of action. Consider a situation in your personal life. Perhaps a close friend consistently disregards your boundaries, encroaching on your time and energy. Rather than reacting impulsively, a stoic mindset encourages you to step back and reflect. Is their behavior a result of their own struggles or a lack of awareness? Understanding the source empowers you to address the situation with wisdom and firmness. In another scenario, envision a family gathering where a relative habitually dismisses your opinions, making you feel invisible. Instead of immediately pushing back, you take a breath and consider. Is their disregard a reflection of deeper family dynamics or personal biases? This moment of reflection guides you in choosing how to assert yourself with tact and grace. In each of these scenarios, the Stoic philosophy encourages this pause, this moment of reflection. It allows us to respond with wisdom and composure rather than reacting impulsively to perceived disrespect. This practice empowers us to choose our responses consciously 
rather than being governed by emotional reactions. The Stoics advocated for this shift in perspective that allows you to hold the reins of your own respect as they understood that teaching others to respect you is not about demanding reverence, but about setting boundaries and embodying the values you hold dear. By adopting a Stoic mindset, you gain the ability to discern between genuine disrespect and instances where actions may be misunderstood. You become the master of your own respect, setting boundaries that guide how others treat you. This way, you don't demand respect. You inspire it through your own actions and values. This practice is not about building walls, but about crafting bridges of understanding and mutual respect. By embracing this philosophy, you teach others how to respect you, not through force, but through example. So, the next time you are faced with disrespect, take a moment. Pause, breathe, and reflect. Consider the source of the disrespect. Is it a reflection of their own struggles, insecurities, or misunderstandings? By understanding their perspective, you gain insight into their actions. Remember, a Stoic doesn't seek to control the actions of others, but rather, they focus on mastering their own responses. It's about upholding your own dignity and values, regardless of external circumstances. In that moment of reflection, you hold the power. You have the ability to choose your response wisely. You can address the situation with grace, assertiveness, and a firm commitment to your own principles. This is the Stoic way. In doing so, you not only preserve your own self-respect, but also offer a valuable lesson to those around you. You show them that respect is earned through integrity, consistency, and unwavering adherence to your principles and in the same time, you teach them how to respect you. Remember, Respect is not just a one-way street. It's a dynamic exchange that flourishes when nurtured with wisdom and mutual understanding. So, stand firm, be the example of respect that others can look up to, and let your actions speak volumes. By embodying these stoic ideals, you'll find that respect naturally gravitates towards you, not out of obligation but out of genuine admiration for the steadfastness of your character. In the end, it's not about demanding respect, but about radiating it through your thoughts, words, and deeds. So, my fellow seeker of wisdom, go forth with the strength of stoicism and let your presence command the respect you rightfully deserve. Keep watching, keep learning, and keep embodying these timeless principles. And remember, your journey towards becoming the best version of yourself is an inspiration to those around you.